Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and hello if you are new, welcome to a new video. Before we do get into this video I just wanted to say a massive Merry Christmas to you all. I hope you have had a lovely lovely day filled with happiness and joy with your loved ones and um, today when I'm filming this it is Christmas day and I am having the most best coziest day ever and um, so today I am filming out what I got for Christmas video. I don't want to do too much of a long intro because there is a lot I mean a lot of stuff to get through um, but before we do jump into what I have been given I did just want to put a little disclaimer out there and say that I am not bragging by showing any of the things that I got for Christmas. I do absolutely love watching these videos myself um, so yes this is literally just a fun little video showing you what I did pick up for Christmas, pick up what I did get for Christmas. So sit back, relax, get your cups of tea and let's get straight into this video. I have got quite a lot of stuff to run it through with you and I am sat on my bed just because everything is really easily accessible so hopefully you don't mind the change of background for one video. Um, the first thing that I did get is what I am wearing and um, I had such a nice shower this morning and the best thing about Christmas is definitely putting on fresh new pyjamas. I believe these are from Primark and they were off mum and dad. They're literally like a velvet velour pink um, set. You have the jumper and then you also get these tie detail bottoms. Um, they are very very pretty and I do absolutely love them. They're definitely very very comfortable and um, so I am very happy with these. Sticking on the theme of pyjamas, the other ones that mum and dad got me are this purpley colour. They do have a pocket there and it is a ribbed material. Um, I do believe that these are like bell sleeves um, because it does look ballooned if you can see that. So this is the top and to go with that the bottoms are like a jogger style so they have an elasticated waist with pockets and then it goes straight into a little cuff at the bottom. These are also super super soft and I cannot wait to wear these either. Literally I love getting new pyjamas for Christmas especially like lounge type ones that you can wear and um, so the ones that don't look like pyjamas but are they're definitely some of the best ones and um, so I think these two were from Primark. I'm probably just going to do these in like no particular order because it's all mismatched from me opening them. The next thing that I got given was these two cups from my sister. Um, they're white and then they have a silver detailing around the front and then a silver handle. Um, I absolutely loved these and she did get me two. These are to put in my box for when I move out. Um, I don't know when I'm moving out but I have been buying little things here and there and um, so when we eventually do I have some stuff and I don't have to buy a lot of things. Um, so these will be going in my home box and I absolutely love these. They brought me two of these ones. Um, I believe these were from HomeSense just by the sticker. Um, it's definitely a home scent sticker but they're these grey mugs and I also got two of these as well. You can definitely tell what my theme will be when I move out. It will definitely be white, grey, silver and mirrored things. Then my sister also got me the plates to match some of the cups that she got. So she got me two of these plates with the silver trimming around the outside as well and these put them they were from H&M Home. She did also get me like a big pasta casserole dish um, which is the same colour as the grey mugs. Um, that's too big to show on camera um, but I also got that as well. 
got given by my sister these really lovely grey slippers um my grey slippers are definitely quite old now so i did need a new pair these feel absolutely amazing and definitely very very comfortable so i cannot wait to put these on my feet i do just look like the comfiest pair of slippers ever and i cannot wait to wear these i don't know where they were from but i think you can get these from a lot of places now um so my sister got me these slippers i also got this hello kitty elasticated headband um so this would be good for if i'm doing my makeup and um, i could put this on to get all the hair out of my face so that would be good for that or if i'm doing my skincare that would be a really good idea to use this as well and um, so i did love that little present that i got off mum and dad i did ask for quite a lot of beanies and hats we all know if you follow me on instagram that i do love my beanies and they're just really good for like days where you really need to wash your hair but you can't be bothered or to do your hair you can't be bothered to do your hair then you can pop these over the top um all of these beanies and hats that i'm going to show you are from asos um when they had a big sale on i did say to mum um can i please have these for christmas and um, so it's a black walled turban i don't know if you're going to be able to see that because it is black and um, but it's oh there you go it's very woolly and it has a knot a tied knot at the front and i just thought that this was really pretty and would definitely keep your head very warm so that was the first one that i got my beanies i do only have a black gray and red one so i did need to expand my collection so i did ask for this like beigey creamy colored one i absolutely love this and think that this would look really nice with like denim jeans or an all black outfit or an all white outfit this would look really nice so i got this one as well and when I seen this one, I definitely fell in love with it. It's literally exactly the same as what I've got on now. It's this pink velvet turban um, beanie sort of styled hat. And I absolutely loved it. I think that this was just really, really pretty. It's definitely quite out there. Um, but I do absolutely love it. And will probably be wearing this later on today. Um, when I seen that I just had to have it and I absolutely loved it. The last hat that I asked for is a bit of a, what's the word, a bit of a risky one. Um, I've never had one of these before and I've never, like, um, I've seen a lot of people wear these over on Instagram and they look absolutely amazing. But again, I don't know if this is going to look good on me. And it's like this cowboy styled bucket hat. And it has a braided trim around here, which I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see. This is what it looks like on, and I don't know if it's going to suit me or not. Um, but I'll have to try it on with some outfits and see how I feel. Um, when I have this on, the first thing that comes to mind is looking like an absolute witch. Um, but once it's styled and my hair's all like curly and whatever, hopefully I will really like it. But as I said, I just feel like a witch at the minute when I put this on. But there you go. The next thing that I asked for was a leather jacket. Now, I am so grateful for this leather jacket because it was quite expensive. Um, and it is from the Couture Club. It feels really heavy and it's definitely quite amazing quality. Um, it's this leather jacket and it has so much detailing on it. I'm trying to show you on the camera. So it looks like it has a lot of spray paint going on. And then this is the back which is definitely one of the best bits about this jacket. it is absolutely gorgeous and i absolutely love it um it was from the couture club and i will link it down below in case anybody does want to purchase it um on the website the design on the leather jacket is a lot different um when this got delivered and i tried it on i did think well this isn't the same one that i ordered off the website and once i clicked through and read the description um it did say that every design is different so it may not look the same 
as what it does on the model on the website. Um, so basically what they're saying is every design on the leather jacket is different and um, which I think is very unique because now nobody is going to have this jacket and I think that that's such an amazing idea. Um, I do absolutely love it and I cannot wait to wear this. I think it would actually look quite nice with this lounge set that I've got on. Um, but what I thought was I could wear this with an all, with an all black outfit and then wear this and I thought that that outfit would look absolutely unreal and um, I cannot wait to style this and I'm pretty sure you will see it all over my Instagram and um, so if you do want to see how I've styled the items that I'm showing you that I got for Christmas then please head over to my Instagram and you will see them a lot over there the next few items that i'm going to show you are shoes and trainers i did ask for some trainers for christmas because the ones that i currently have i have definitely worn to death and needed new ones and um, so i did ask for some converse i just asked for the plain black high top ones i definitely think you cannot go wrong with a pair of black high top converse um, i don't have any and have never owned a black pair um, i do have white pairs which are absolutely ruined um, and i have always wanted a black pair so when mum asked me what i wanted for christmas i did ask if i could have these um, i cannot wait to wear them and i am a size two if anybody wondered and then i got these absolutely gorgeous shoes i love them these are off somebody very special um they're these nike jordans they look like so when these came out i knew that i wanted them i absolutely love these trainers and i cannot wait to wear them i think that they will look amazing with an all black outfit or with leather look leggings um i just cannot wait to style these um i do want um the all red pair i think the red ones look sick um but i cannot wait to wear these these again are a size two so they were from the children's section and um, but these will become one of my favorite pairs of trainers probably and the last pair of shoes that i got um i have wanted for such such a long time um and they are a pair of dr martins um, I have always wanted the paint and pair and mum and dad did get me some for Christmas. Again, I am a size 2 so these were from the children's section and they were a bit cheaper. Um, if you do shop in the children's with quite small feet then you will obviously get your shoes and trainers a lot cheaper. Um, from the adult section I think these were around £135. Um, but because they were from the children's I think they were around um, 40 to 60 pounds so you do get them a lot lot cheaper and um, which is definitely a bonus if you have small feet like moi and um, so again I cannot wait to wear these and I cannot wait to style them and um, I did want the paint and pair because I just think that it's a bit different and I do really really like paint and shoes so cannot wait to wear these next we're moving on to the other side i've put them into two piles my cousin lydia definitely knows me very well and she has obviously been watching my videos and she knows that i do burn a lot of wax melts and i am always lighting tea lights so she got me this massive beautiful gray jar and inside are literally like hundreds of tea lights it is literally just filled to the top with tea lights and this is quite heavy and in comparison it's quite big and um, so i absolutely love this present and i think i will be going through these quite a lot and um, this definitely won't last me very long um, so i just thought that this was such a thoughtful present and one that will definitely become very useful and she also got me which i haven't smelt yet it's the Island Spa Fragrance Diffuser um, and this is from Next. The packaging is so nice of this and I cannot wait to smell it and see 
what it smells like. Um, by the title Island Spa, I think it will smell really nice. Um, apparently this will scent up your home for up to nine weeks. Um, I do love room diffusers, which she obviously knows. Um, so I cannot wait to whack this out and try and find somewhere to put it in my bedroom. I am trying to go through these quite quickly because I am aware that I do have quite a lot of things. Um, but I do want to try and show you everything that I have picked up. Um, so hopefully this video won't take too long. Um, but the next things that I wanted to show you are what Kai brought me. Let me get them all out. He got me three presents. I didn't tell him what I wanted this year. Um, so I think he's done amazingly. Um, normally I say what I want every year and he'll just buy me that and wrap it up. Um, but this year I didn't tell him anything that I wanted. To be fair I didn't really ask for anything or expect anything. Um, but what he's got me I'm so so happy with. Um, so I unwrapped this and I was a bit like what um it's a giuseppe zanati box and i absolutely love this box i think it is so beautiful um i will obviously be using what's inside but i will keep the box and probably display it somewhere and um, because i think it's absolutely amazing i didn't want to open it when i received it because it was that nice side it looks like this and then the present comes with a really pretty black silk dust bag with the logo there. And he got me a new purse. I just think that this is absolutely beautiful. It is not my usual style, don't get me wrong. Um, but I do absolutely love it and it was very thoughtful of him. So this will be becoming my new purse. Um, if you watch my gift guide video, I did say to you all that you can never have too many purses. Um, so I am absolutely buzzing with this. And the inside is quite big. You've got quite a lot of space for everything in there. One second. Hello? Sorry? I'm filming my what I got for Christmas video. Look at my coat. It looks nice. DKNY. Yeah. Very nice. Do you like it? Yeah. Hi Logan. <laughs> Is it Kenny? Yeah, it's really nice. What's that? Okay. Oh, Bye. Love you, Baba. Bizarre. As I was showing you Kai's presents, he literally just rang me. Um, but as I was saying, it is really, really spacious inside. Um, it isn't my usual style, but I do absolutely love it. And I think it is very thoughtful. He obviously knows that I like silver. So thank you, Kai, for that. I do absolutely love it. Um, all I wanted to show you, it also came with obviously like the receipt and things. But there was this picture inside. I don't know whether you can see that and it's absolutely beautiful so what I might do is put this in like a really nice frame and have this in my bedroom I just think it would be like quite a nice decorative picture um the Giuseppe Zanzanti not Zanzanti what is it Giuseppe Zanati oh my god I really am butchering that name please don't laugh at me in the comments and um, but all of their stuff is really really nice um, and it is quite expensive so when I did see that box I was a bit shocked because of course I didn't ask for anything. The next two presents that he got me are in these white boxes with ribbon which are super super cute and I will probably keep these boxes again as like a decorative thing because I think that that would be really nice to put on display. Um, he's obviously listened to what I, what I have been looking at and what I have wanted because he picked me up this beautiful necklace it's jeweled and it has butterflies on it I'm not sure whether you can see it will be a bit awkward um, and this is from IC Season they are an Instagram shop and quite a lot of influencers do wear her jewellery and I just thought that it was absolutely beautiful and when I seen that necklace I definitely definitely wanted it 
Um, I've had my eye on it for so long and I've never hinted to him that I've wanted it. I did put it on my Instagram saying, Santa, if you are watching this, please can I have this for Christmas? So he's obviously seen my Instagram story and brought it. Um, but he did pick me up something else from the same brand which was another necklace which I wasn't expecting and it is the same one but it is a bit more blingier um, this one has little jewels on the end and I just thought that this one would be really nice for if I'm going out I could wear this literally how blingy is that but I do absolutely love that one as well. And I will probably wear this one for like more special occasions. Um, as I said, it is a lot blingier. Um, and they do come in like these little white pouches, which are super cute as well. Um, so Kai did get me those three presents that I am super happy with. And I think that they are all very pretty. And I've definitely been very, very spoiled this Christmas if I do say so myself oh my god this is absolutely massive so every Christmas mum and dad do us like little stocking fillers so like little knickknacks of things that we run out of or that are essentials but this year mum literally put them all in this massive box with cellophane over the top and like a big bow um this is absolutely massive you can't even see me but it's absolutely filled with loads and loads of goodies so i'm just going to get them out and show you what she got us um hairspray cannot go wrong with hairspray an essential always needed and this is the one that i use it's the silver ken classic hairspray she got me this see-through jar which i absolutely loved and inside you put cotton pads so i just thought that that was a super fun idea and something that would again look quite nice in my bedroom so i cannot wait to put these in there and i'll probably have it on display so for that jar she got two packs of cotton pads i say she but dad also got me this stuff and um, but we all know that the mums are the ones that shop for your presents um next i got these two pack of makeup remover mitts from primark these are used to remove your makeup and you basically put your hand in it like a fake tan mitt and um, you wet these and then you use it to remove your makeup and um, i've never used anything like this before so i am super excited to try it i'll probably use this this evening I then got a four pack of exfoliating gloves. Mum is forever throwing mine away because she always says that they contain loads of bacteria and germs. And um, so I have got a four pack. I absolutely love these. They are an essential and they are always needed. And um, so to get these for Christmas is definitely a good thing. Didn't know what I was going to say there. Then I got some deodorant, can never have too much deodorant. I also got these pastel highlighters. We all know that I'm definitely very into my stationery, um, so you can never go wrong with those. And this was wrapped up inside of the hamper. It's this Safe and Glory Pamper Hamper. Um, you get an eye mask a bath bomb the clean on me cleanser the scrub of your life a face mask and a body wash um i absolutely love soap and glory things the eye mask and the scrub of my life are definitely two of my favorite things from soap and glory and what i probably use most often um i have actually got the scrub of your life here and um, because i did use it this morning when i had a shower um, and the Clean On Me cleanser I have never actually tried before so I am excited to try that. Um, these are really full sized products, they are quite big. Um, so this is actually such a good present for somebody. Um, I absolutely love this and cannot wait to use the other items that are in there. I then got money off mum, dad, nan and granddad. Um, so I have about £120 in there. 
and then the last few things that I got were chocolate that were in the hamper. So I've got some Aeros and some Haribos. Cannot go wrong with sweets, always a good thing to have. So that was what was in this big hamper. Um, definitely the essentials and things that are always needed. I've now got to try and put all of this stuff back in here. One thing about Christmas is when you get all of your presents, you then have to like try and make room for everything. So your room is literally always a mess for a few days because you have to try and decanter everything into parts of your bedroom. Um, so that was that massive hamper that I got. Um, I do have just some little presents now to show you. Um, I know that this video has gone on for a very long time, so I won't keep you for too long. My nan, as well as money, also got me this Ted Baker Little Bloom gift set. Um, you get a perfume, a body wash, a shower gel and all of that jazz. Um, this is just a really pretty gift to get somebody and I always use stuff like this, so win-win. I absolutely love anything like this. I then got some Christmas Percy Pigs off some of the work girls. You cannot go wrong with Percy Pigs. I absolutely love them. They are my favourite sweets. So I will probably be munching on these this evening. I then got this really pretty glass with E on it. I just think that that is so nice. And even if you display that in your bedroom with a tea light in, I think that would look really pretty. Um, obviously you can use this as a glass as well and drink out of it. Duh. Um, but I just thought that that was really, really nice. And I do really like that. I then got some nails. These are the ones that I have been using recently. They're just a stiletto nail with a French tip on the top. I absolutely love these. And the work girls obviously do listen to what I like. Um, this was my secret Santa present. Um... And I do really, really like these. I will be using them. I did get two packs, but I have already got some on now. Um, I did that this morning. And the last thing that I wanted to show you was this candle that I got. I did get two of the same, so I will only show you one. Um, it's this really pretty candle from Olivia Blake. And it's the Wild Mint scent. If only there was smell -o vision this smells absolutely amazing and the girl at work that got it me said you could have this in the background of your videos and I literally just thought that, that was so cute and thoughtful. It does smell absolutely amazing, it's so fresh and you can definitely smell the mint in it. Um, so she got me two of the same and I absolutely love the smell of these. Um, my work friends definitely do know me very very well. The last thing that I wanted to show you to end this video off is two presents from Kai's mum which she got me for Christmas this year. Um, she got me a homemade gift which she made herself which I thought was very very thoughtful um, and it's this glass and inside there are lights. In person this is absolutely gorgeous, it's so pretty um, and this can also go in the background of my videos. Um, it just looks absolutely lovely and I think it's very, very pretty and I love it. Definitely a thoughtful gift um, and I absolutely love thoughtful gifts at Christmas. And the last thing that I got was another pair of pyjamas. Again, you can never have too many. Um, it's this hooded, colourful leopard print set. Um, so it's like this and it does have a hood at the back. Um, it's very, very soft and it has a cuffed sleeves. So this is the top with the hood, as you can see. And the bottoms are exactly the same. They have an elasticated waist and then they do go, they are a straight leg, um, which I absolutely love. These are super, super soft material and I cannot wait to wear all of my new pyjamas that I've received. So that is the end of the what I got for Christmas video everybody. I cannot believe Christmas is over and I have actually filmed my first what I got for Christmas video. This will obviously become a tradition and something that I do every year. 
hopefully you have enjoyed seeing what I have been given for Christmas I am very very grateful and a lot of these presents are very thoughtful and quite expensive and so I am very grateful and pleased with everything that I have received and um, again I'm not bragging I just wanted to show you all what I got as I love watching these videos myself um, hopefully this video hasn't been too long and if you have stuck around to the end then thank you I've literally been speaking for so long that I think I've actually lost my voice so thank you for watching everybody and I will see you in my next video <laughs>